working with uh, Paulo on uh, blind and trees. I'm just running him across this, this open bean field that's been picked. Just trying to get him to run a straight line. So I got some bumpers lined up down through here. I'm just gonna cast him back across this bean field. So it's important to get your dog lined up in the right direction. If they're sitting crooked, they're gonna run the wrong way. So it's very important to start out with your dog facing the direction and the body position straight in line with the direction you want them to go. Sit. Line. Back. Back. Good dog. So I don't know if you can tell, but he's kind of offset. He's he's facing more towards that house, and I need him to go over over towards the green roof to the white house. I need him to go over here to this log cabin. So I'm just gonna try to get him straightened back up. Here. Good. Line. I just got these bumpers set up like a ladder. I got a bumper and then a little further bumper, a little further bumper. All the way at the end, I got five bumpers and a pile. Yep. Yep. Good. 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 He's lined up pretty good there, so I'm just going to go ahead and send him. Line. If you see that he looked the other way, I, I didn't send him. I want him to be facing the way I want him to go. Line. Back. It's very important to get that dog's body straight. So that was the last one that I got in the ladder. The next one will be at the pile, and there's five of them back here. Yep. Good dog. Good dog. I've said it before, I'm not a pro professional dog trainer. Uh, I'm just doing this, just trying to motivate people into training their old, own dogs. Um, if I can do it, you can do it. Um, it's some some of it's simple. Uh, just so, so so what we got to think about is sit. what we want our dogs to do. Like, what's the main thing that we want? We want our dog to just go pick up the bird and bring it back, and that's that's pretty much it. Um, as far as blind retrieving, it's not, I shouldn't say it's not necessary because if you're shooting multiple birds, then it is necessary because your dog can't see them all. And you, you know, you just want to send your dog out there and then your dog bring the bird back. But if you're wanting to self-train a hunting partner, just simply, just, just to go hunting with you, um, blind retrieving is not something that I, I think is a, is a requirement for training your dog. If you want to take your dog that far, absolutely. Uh, but if you just want your dog to go and retrieve your birds out of the water for you then Just getting them to retrieve and bring the bird back sit be patient calm no whining. So thanks for watching